Hey guys, I am making my son Costas's favorite vegetable, cauliflower. I'm gonna roast it super simple. You're gonna love this. It'll be part of your repertoire each weeknight. So stick around for this episode of Cook This. I'm doing an easy side dish. So here's a tip. When you get your nice big head of cauliflower, which it's in season right now, so you're gonna see some beautiful heads of cauliflower. And you can use any cauliflower, the white, the purple, orange, green, beautiful variety of cauliflower. All right, to cut it into florets, here's what you wanna do. So naturally break it where you see the stem, but you see it's too big. So we want even cooking, we wanna cut them all evenly. Cut into the stem, just slice down and pull it apart with your paring knife. That way, you get these nice, beautiful florets and it doesn't cut the top. Keeps it nice and pretty, like a little flower. All right, my florets are ready to go. I like to group them in the middle. I know, I say that a lot. It just makes it so much easier. So now you just wanna drizzle a good olive oil, not extra virgin, just regular olive oil. We wanna taste the fruitiness of the olive oil. Season it with salt and pepper. And just toss it. I'm gonna to pop it into my oven, 400 degrees until they're nice and tender and caramelized. That's what makes them really great. Look at that, look how beautiful. We have this beautiful caramelization. So I added a little bit more oil than I would, let's say when I'm roasting broccoli, because there's not as much natural moisture in cauliflower. So a little bit of extra oil does the trick. And now I'm just gonna pop it in five more minutes. So I'm gonna toss in my pine nuts, which gives it a nice, beautiful, nutty flavor, and then toast them. So five more minutes and then it's done. That's how easy this side dish is. All right, Parmigiano Reggiano, right over the top. It's nutty, it's salty, and beautiful freshness from lemon zest. So you have that pretty lemon yellow color right over the top, and there you have it. An easy side dish for any night of the week. Pair it with roasted chicken, grilled chicken steak, pork chops, you name it. This is a good one. Go to the newspaper's website, look up this recipe, and for more of my fresh and easy recipes, go to my website at tweetneats.com.